Hello everyone, welcome back to part 2 of Chukin Sosig Walk the Plank. Uh, it's a little where we ended last time, as we got off the island, we're on the pirate ship. And, um, yep, so we're gonna continue right from there, right in the ocean, where we were before. Chukin Sosig, boo doo boo 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 doo boo 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 doo You can so sick. That's how I like to say it. You can so sick. So we have, uh, I remember when we get back, when we get back into here, we have three different islands that we can choose from. And let's see, one looks like it has the dragon with a gate. This one looks like it's just a regular old island with something in the middle that I can't see because it's question marks. And this one looks like another island with a little hut. Oh, I don't know if we want to go to the dragon yet because that seems like it'll be... I don't know. Let's do this one. Let's see if we can land there. Let's see what that brings us on our adventure. The neat thing about this when they're flipping back and forth between uh, this area where you're actually looking for stuff, and then the area with friends. It's neat, because they're playing like a D&D &D game where they um, come up with a story, and we're walking through it. And it's cool. Let's go! Alright. A windsock? That is a windsock. For the wind's feet. I reckon that's how it works anyways. It says, Goblin Island Nature Reserve Conservation Trust. There's posters on here, too. The lizard. It's an article about a really daft-looking lizard. Oh, I mean, not a lizard. It's got a nice smile. It does have a nice smile. We got the Lumi Orchid. The Goblin Isle Lumi Orchid. This rare orchid can only can be found on Goblin Isle. Requ requires full sun to bloom. Its flowers emit a beautiful ultraviolet light. Sounds pretty. And we've got the Kiki! Kiki Poo! Kiki Poo! Kiki Poo! It's a little notice about the Kiki Poo! Feathery avocado like parrot which loves to dance. Incredibly shy and difficult to spot. The Kiki Poo! Someone who wrote this really likes Kiki Poo. They seem pretty angry. They don't. They don't. They seem pretty angry they don't win Bird of the Year every year. It veers off at the end into a huge rant. Okay. Does this have, uh... Alright, so that's all. Okay. Let's get out of there. Uh, let's go find a Kikapoo! And maybe an island, and maybe a lizard, and maybe a goblin. Ooh, that must be the Kikapoo, but we gotta get rid of these thick leafy leafies. Ah, oh, there's a goblin. It's really thick. Leafy growth. If that orchid has any hope of growing, I'll need to remove it. It's really sturdy though, I'll need something to cut it. And that must be the orchid. Yes. It's growing in a really shady spot here. Which is not good for that orchid orchid, because it needs to be in a really sunny spot for it to bloom. There's some shears right there, which would be great if I can take those. But goblins, let's see what they have in store. Goblin Isle. Oh! Goblins! That's what I say when I run into goblins too, I get surprised, I go, oh! Goblins! Wait, what? Why are the goblins here? After it got told to behave and stick to the theme? I lost all the pirate pieces. But I had some goblins left over. I can make them fit in. Ah, that sounds... That's so unfair. I can make dinosaurs fit in. No. No, he says. No. 
Can I take these? Do you have any scissors? No! <laughs> Our scissors! Keep your nasty hands off! They're just lying on the ground! So? That's where we keep them! We know exactly where they are. Well, that seems crazy. It's a large cooking pot full of... something. It's over some kindling and wood, but it's unlit. Ooh, I have a torch! Cheeky Goblin. Hey there. Hey, Stinky. Ha <laughs> ha Stinky. What are you doing? Top secret Goblin stuff. Making a mean soup. Hey! It's meant to be a secret. Goblin knowledge only. I put a potato in it. What else is in the soup? Well, potato! I got a potato in it for sure. We've been working on it for a week. Wow. It's a bit hard to remember everything. If we like know how it tastes, in it goes. I put a lot of sugar in it. Oh yeah, we love sugar. We just need to heat it up now. The only problem we're having is lighting the fire. I don't like cold soup. I'm getting so hungry. Wasting away by the second. What about if I light the fire? Oh, we would give you a mighty treasure. Close to our hearts. Yep, yep, yep. So shiny. So mighty. Our floor scissors! Can I have the scissors? If fire lit... I think not. Fire first. Then scissors. Ah, okay. See you both later. Well, <laughs> we'll smell you first. <laughs> so they think I'm stinky, so let's do torch. Can we do torch? I don't want to use a torch on that. Why would you not want to use a torch on the thing to light it? So I actually need like a... So maybe I gotta light the torch somehow first. Huh, thinking. Okay, check out the parrot. Whoa, ah! He almost got me! That's a real angry parrot. Our baby. That's our boy. We love him so much. So proud. We go into their huts. No. All right. So, uh, looks like there's not much to do here. The orchid is a thing, but we gotta get the scissors. But we gotta get fire to light this thing. So that's where we're at right now. I don't see any of those cheeky little birds. The copa copa popo, copa de popa popo. We got that orchid, and I didn't see any lizards either. So, I think we might have to head out of here and go to a different island. I think that's uh, what we're gonna have to do. So let's do that. Let's go to the world map. So I'm thinking, I'm thinking that maybe that dragon will help us out with the fire, since I have a torch, but it's not lit. So that's up at Goblin Island. So let's check out this place. See what they have to offer. See what kind of clues we need over here. What we gotta get. What we gotta do. Right. Let's do that. Oh, this looks nice. Adventurers Guild. Ooh, look at that. It's a dodo. I'm not sure what this bird did to deserve being a planter. That is pretty terrible. I'm sure it must have deserved it. And there's really angry griffin. I guess Hebel is making do with this for now. Till he manages to actually kill one. We got that picture of kittens. It's a painting of two kittens. It's a powerful image. With strong, chaotic energy. Just like Hebel. Arrows. We got another pot over here. We got me. Let's go in more. Boar's head. It's the head of the polar bear rug. Okay, it's pretty dead. It's a lion. Or was a lion at least. It looks incredibly pleased with itself. He is very handsome. Something's up with this, I know it. Squid. It's 
a mounted squid. It's not even a terrifying giant squid. It's just a regular squid. Stuck to a piece of wood. It's a deer! It makes me feel all festive. Okay, mouse. We got a mouse. Look at that. Stone tablet with a funny cat story carved into it. Okay, ooh, a button. Ooh, how cute. It's a little executive desk cannon. Light that on fire. I don't want to use a torch on anything. Hey, a Hebel. Nice office. I like the decoration. Oh, cheers. Glad you appreciate my fine taste. I'm super rich. I also really like nature. So much you want to kill everything? Yeah, it's sort of like that thing. Or something so cute, you just can't handle it. I'm just so dang passionate about nature. Wow. Okay, Hebel. You little orange ball of energy. You're a little crazy. Heavenly, heavenly, who? Just as well, I'm already dead. I'm criminally cute. <laughs> it's like little fluffy baby animals and stuff. I just want to hug them so hard. Ah, they hurt me. Are you saying cows not cute? Nah, nah, it's not that. That's what I heard. I'm pretty hurt now. Why don't you say you'd hug me? Dead. I think you're cute, cow. <laughs> See? These are real friends. Fine. Fine, I'd kill you. Are you happy now? Very. Me meow. <laughs> That's cool. It goes back to where they're in real life and there's a little bit of banter between them. That's cool. Uh, so you like animals then? <laughs> Can't get enough of them. I feel like covering every inch of space with them. Dead though. When they're alive, they tend to just run riot. There was a flamingo. They just seem to behave so much better when they're dead. Understandable. Where did you find all these animals? All over the place. I've got my fine seafaring vessel. I take it and bravely explore new lands. Was that the little pedal-powered swan boat outside? Yeah, she's real reliable. Stunning. Yeah, I had to keep drawing up a map. I'd hate to lose it. Where is this map now? It, it should be somewhere in the guild hall here. It always tries... I always try and keep it nearby. I'm super proud of it. I have a thing for just displaying everything. I've got to display my passions proudly. Talk to you later. See you around. Alright, so there's a map somewhere in the guild hall. Really? We got the cannon. It's, it's this. This this has to be the map. The tatty looking picture looks like it has something behind it. Of course. Oh, there's something back there. Take it. I'm sure I'm doing Hebel a favor. Take the map. That's much better. Kittens make me uneasy. All that youth. It's a really odd looking map. There's only a few islands on it. I should talk to Hebel about it. Let's do that. Let's go back to Hebelie. Hey Hebel, nice office. I found the map. Oh sweet, what did you think? I knew it was around here somewhere. There's only a few islands on it though. It seems a bit empty. Oh yeah, that's really important. I drew on the other island. Drew on the other island in ultraviolet ink. I can't have pirates stealing all my info. But Hebel, I am a pirate. Ah, sure you are. <laughs> you need, like, a hook for a hand or something. Is the eye patch not good enough? We both know your eye works fine. How can I view the whole map? You'll need an ultraviolet light. If you shine the light over the map, the other islands would appear. Super cool spy level stuff. Aren't I smart? I'm the smartest. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, cool. So we know where we uh, gotta go to get those right light. It is the plant. Uh, but first. Stuff we saw. Let's check that out. Alright, nothing, nothing going on with stuff we saw. So let's go up to the dragon. 
the dragon because we need to get that plant growing so we can have it so that we can look at the map to see the other islands. And the only way to get the map is for the ultraviolet flower to grow. The only way to get it to grow is to get the scissors. So we've got to get the torch to get lit by the dragon to light the pot so the goblins will be happy and give us the scissors so we can cut the leaves and grab the ultraviolet plant and bring it back to Hebel to shine it on the map. Woo! Okay. Makes sense, right? That's that's the plan. Look at that. A worn out crumbling wall. A little stone dragon is still guarding it though. It's doing a good job with what's left. Alright. Door. Leg. This leg seems to be a lever, but it's stuck. There must be a way to unlock it nearby. Let's push on the eyeball. That looks shiny. All the legs just move. Prodding it in the eye no longer does anything. Alright, I should try playing with the legs. Alright, what about that leg? What about this leg? Haha! Uh -huh. Success! Very good, let's go. Whoa. Into the cave we go! Much better! This is going really well. I have a plan. I have a plan in place. You always gotta have a plan. You never know. Uh, if you go out there just without a plan, you, you'll accomplish nothing. That's that's what I'm saying. You should all know that. Oh boy. Uh, let's switch on the wall. Boink. Fantastic. Hey, it's cow. Cow, cow, cow. Nice. Nice. Yeah, this is pretty nice. This is pretty, I like this little cave. Can we put this in the fire? Nice and. Can I put that in the pot? Oh, fantastic. I did it. Good. Good, good, good. All right, well, let's go talk to Kao since we're here. Goddess water. Bottles of goddess water. After reading over the label, I'm still not sure what it is. Apart from that, it's water. Huh. I think this really is just water. It claims it's the best water, though. I can't argue with a printed label. And let's talk to Kao. What's up, Kao? Uh, hey, Kao. Hey, check it out. I joined a cult. <laughs> nice. Um, it's not so bad. What is this cult? Rest Water Sail. I got a whale song CD for joining. Ah, oh, cute. I'm my own boss. I can sell holy water and work on my poems at the same time now. Poems are my passion. I've been told they are super calming. Great for putting people to sleep. No. Where's everyone else? Well, they said they were heading out to the shops. That was three weeks ago. Do you think they might have quit? I'm not sure. I read them one of my poems. They all calmed right down. They got so much less aggressive about meeting sales targets. Did they seem happy? They did, actually. Can I join this cult? Wait, what? You want to actually sign up? Really? I mean, that's fantastic. I ran out of whale CDs, I'm afraid. But I've got this instead. A voucher for a free prize. Oh wow, thanks. You'll need to redeem it at the general store. I can't wait to teach you all the benefits of goddess water. Is there anything else you can tell me about your cult? Goddess water? It's a lifestyle, not just a product. It's all about sales and living the dream. It's great because we all are our own bosses and set our own hours. I sold everything I had, but it was so worth it. I'm really close to reaching diamond level. What is diamond level? I don't know, but it's diamond. It has to be important. Okay, talk to you later, man. Statue of the Sea Goddess. Or what she's supposed to be. She's an icon! Alright, lamps. So we've got uh, more goddess water. 
All right, so he's gonna get rich off of selling Goddess Water. Fantastic. We've got our torch. So there was no dragon here, but there was cow. We got our torch. And let's get out of here and go light up that pot and get that part done. This is gonna be fantastic. The goblins are gonna be super happy. And then we're gonna get the ultraviolet flower. And then we're gonna bring the ultraviolet flower to Hevel and light up that map. Let's do that. Oh no! The rain- <sighs> really? I think it might need some help staying lit. Well, that ruined my plan. Remember when I was talking about plans? Uh, sometimes plans change. Um, as you can see, that totally changed what I was going to do. But at least I had a plan. But now my new plan is I'm going to go to Cape Cod Napper, and then I'm going to go get the free gift from the general store. Because that free gift will hopefully have something to do with keeping the fire going. Hey, kept him in. Alright, let's go to the general store. And give Cow the free gift, the ticket, gift voucher. Can we do that? Boink. What is this voucher for? Oh, that's a ticket for a free item from my Box of Wonders! Take anything you want from the box down front. Ah, nice. Let's see what's in here. Hmm. It looks like this piece of sandpaper. Only useful thing in here. Enjoy your item. And don't forget to shop with cow. Ugh, piece of sandpaper. Yeah, I don't want to sand that. Alright, so let's think. What can we do with the sandpaper? It's, see, I, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. There's nothing else here, man. Hey, cow. No, let's go back out here. Sandpaper, sandpaper, sandpaper. What are we gonna do with the sandpaper? Oh, now we're gonna figure that out. Sandpaper. That thing's going fine. Can we sandpaper your your fortune ball? Your crystal ball? Oh! So this is one of the merchant cow's fantastic prizes then. It really does set the bar low. Really? Sandpaper. You can't do it on the ball. Oh, let's see. What are we going to do? What are we going to do? Sandpaper. First. Oh, now there's two cats on the ground. Huh. Cat star dance party. So what are we going to sandpaper this? Yes, sandpaper that. Sandpaper that. Yeah, I know. Hey. What have you heard about treasure? I heard... There's a haunted island with untold riches. What? Really? Yeah, someone's been sending out flyers. I think the haunt part is putting people- I right, read this last time. Alright. Uh, sea goddess. We read that last time too. Alright, see you man. See you on your boat! Alright, so we have to... Sandpaper, Adventures Guild, Goblin Island, Cape Cod, or Sea Shrine. So we have to find something here that. Sandpaper. There's the map, we can't use the ultraviolet lights on it. Sandpaper. Can we sandpaper something here? Maybe? How about this thing? What do you want to use? Sand Let's give it in. I really don't want to. Alright. Give me sandpaper that. What's my thing? Yeah, yeah. It just needs a flame. 
Okay, so we can't flame that one. Uh, sandpaper, 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 boar's head. What are we gonna do with sandpaper? Boink! We push it again. Alright, it's done. Uh, sandpaper, sandpaper. What makes sense to do with sandpaper? What makes sense? Let's go to the Goblin Isle real quick. See if there's anything there. Sandpaper. I'm gonna have to do some thinking. Some thinking on this one. Sandpaper. Can I put it on there? Nope. We can't sandpaper on the windsock. Uh, that doesn't make sense. Does that make sense at all? No, it definitely doesn't. Sandpaper, 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 sandpaper on those? No, that wouldn't make sense. Why would we do that? We're here. Let's give the sandpaper to their baby. Alright, can we sandpaper the pot? No. Nope. There's sandpaper on your face. No. Alright, we're gonna fill it with the sandpaper spore then. Alright, get that guy with the dragon. Uh, we were so close, and then it had to rain. So close, and then it had to rain. What would you use sandpaper for? You sand wood things with sandpaper, right? That's what you do. Sand wood things with the wood paper. Wood paper pecker. Wood pecker. Hmm. Sandpaper. Sea shrine. There's something in the sea shrine that. Well, why would there be. Uh, there's a goddess statue, some crystal light. Uh, can I put the sandpaper with my thing to make it better? Hmm. Sandpaper on there? No. Is there something in here that I need that I can sand with? Hmm. Go downstairs. At least I'm part of this cult now. That's good. No. No. Give it to him. Here's some sandpaper. I don't think Kyle will like that. So maybe the sandpaper just goes to someone. Hmm. Alright, well we will uh, end this episode here, part two, over um, the hunt for the sandpaper treasure. What are we going to do with the sandpaper? I don't know. We'll figure this out though. But for now, that'll do. Uh, we're going to keep going with this. This is going to be great. We forgot what to do with the sandpaper. We had, remember, we had a plan, and then we couldn't stick to the plan because we got kind of derailed from the plan, uh, plan because, of, because of the rain. Um, that's not gonna stop us. We're gonna figure out what to do with sandpaper. We're gonna get the torch lit. We're gonna get the stew lit. We're gonna get the orchid. We're gonna get the bigger map. And it's gonna be great. But that's all in the next episode. Bye!